And today we have a little treat for you. Um, brand new camper came in, made by Cruiser RV. It is a Radiance. I have never, ever personally seen one of these, so um, you can kind of explore it with me a little bit. I actually went through and made the first video until I found this nifty little trapdoor in this, uh, this area here. This is on wheels, rolls and pulls out, which is kind of nifty. Uh, kind of goes in stores and flips down like that and you've got a cover on it. Now, if you're going to put anything in here, I don't really know if you're going to have that full section open and available for uh, being able to pull that thing up and out, but it's just a cool little feature. Um, does have power stabilizer jacks, huge awning like uh, you guys know I like, pre-wired for a backup camera, place to tie uh, the dog up. There are your stabilizers. Uh, model code on here is a 25BH if I haven't mentioned that already. Weight on here, 6,023, so not too shabby. I am going to kind of show you this little control panel here just because uh, this battery disconnect is quite interesting. More toy hauler-ish. Alright, moving on in. Standard uh, entertainment system. Uh, front and center here when you first pull in nice backlit clean white lights I am a fan of those uh, as opposed to the blue ones for whatever reason does have uh, roller shades so little drawstrings pull it down covers everything up uh, they do go up fairly nice so you can just kind of let them rock and roll like that moving around Standard 12 volt fridge. Pretty uh, pretty norm nowadays. Looks like I got a little battery coming on, but digital thermostat. Uh, traditional double bunks over here. Decent weight capacity. Um, this I did find uh, a little odd, just having a random pipe in that storage area. Do have a decent size storage. And, and again, these doors are, they're wood, they're thick. I mean, I'm sure they're press board or something like that, but I like these. Styling of it, black line through it kind of breaks everything up. Uh, moving into the bathroom, pretty standard fare, corner medicine cabinet, sink, uh, bathtub. John, it's actually at a nice angle if you see, kind of using the maximum space. Um, storage in here. Um, we're gonna get to two pet peeves I have with this camper and uh, this is one. Um, no shower curtain. Again probably five dollars on Walmart or maybe less. But again if I'm being nitpicky. Plenty of kitchen storage room. I mean these cabinets are they're large for what this camper is. And you got them all the way across the top. Of course, you do have a ducted AC. Now that those, those shades are drawn, you can kind of see that entertainment system stands out a little cleaner. I am going to move you into the, the bedroom here. Um, it does have a king size bed, um, but this is uh, pet peeve number two. And it is not that it has a king size bed by any means. It is the fact that the king size bed is not centered all the way up against this wall. And again, this is all screwed down and this is where it should be. And again, it is screwed down for some reason. Oh, I can get it up. Oh, it's just coming all apart now. It is screwed down, it's not designed to move. So I just pulled the thing away from the wall. Uh, moving around. That is interesting. See this, I've never seen before. Huge storage. And that's why it's screwed down to this. So I was just lifting that whole thing up. And this is just a board on here, I'm guessing. And uh, maybe this will get rid of my pet peeve, but I can slide this thing over to the center. Look at that, pet peeve gone. Again, <laughs> you guys got to explore this one with me. I did have to, like I said, redo the video once because I found that exterior tray and 
All right, B, this is, uh, this is way, way better. And look, now that we found that, shower curtain sitting down here too, so pet peeve number two gone. Holy crap. That has just transformed this camper into a completely different animal for me, so. Pretty, pretty cool. Maybe next time I do a video, I take a couple more minutes and, you know, look around, do my job right. But I guess until then, take a look at this beauty.